we'll guide you through how to download and install mods in Minecraft 1.21.8. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. Doing this means you can then go and run mods. So to go and get started, we need to go and quit out of Minecraft. Here we are on the desktop. Go and open up a web browser of your choice. I'm using Chrome. And what we want to do is go and type in forge like so. You want to come to the official site, which is files.minecraftforge.net. Go over to the left and you can go and press 1.21.8 and we can go and see forge here. So you can go and press installer. You're going to be taken to an add or off all here. Just be aware if you see a download button, it's for the add. You need to go and wait for the skip button in the top right and then it will go and download. You've now got Forge, but what we can do is go and get some mods for it. So there are different mod sites out there. One I like to use is called Curse Forge. So you search for it and come to curseforge.com. Select Minecraft and you can press browse all. Go down on the left and you can go to game version. And what you can do is select 1.21.8. Scroll through here and you can go and find a mod that you want. You can get multiple as well. For example, I'll get Zero's minimap. We can then press files at the top. Scroll down and we can go and see the different versions here. Make sure you get it for 1.21.8 and forge. Press the three dots to the right and press download. Now you can go and wait. You can go and get more mods. Just make sure they're for 1.21.8 and for forge. Before we get any further, a big shout out to the sponsor of this video, Apex Hosting. If you're in need of a Minecraft server, I'll link them down below in the pinned comment and the description. They've got so many great benefits and at the moment you can get the discount as well. So come and check them out. If we scroll down, we can go and see they've got one click install mod packs, DDoS protection, 24 seven servers and support, meaning you can go and get the help anytime you need it ultra latency, instant setup, and much more as well. So a big thanks to them for sponsoring this video. Let's go and continue. What we need to do is go and open up File Explorer. You want to go and you can right click on and press downloads or just go over to the left and go and find downloads. And what you then want to do is go and find Forge. Go and double click on it like so, and it should then go and pop up like this. Now, if it doesn't, maybe nothing happens or something else happens, it's slightly because you don't have Java. So go and open up a web browser at the bottom, and then you want to go and type in java.com or just search for it, press download, download it and install it. Return to Forge and right click on it, hover over open with, and you want to press choose another app and select Java and press always. And it should then go and run. If it still doesn't, you may need to do something called a jar fix, which will relink jar and jar files together again. Then you can say install client and press OK and let it run through. It will go and install. After it has, press search at the bottom and type in Minecraft Launcher. At the top, you need to press installations and start scrolling down. Find Forge, hover over it and press the file or folder icon to the right. This will open up and in here you need to go and scroll down and go and find the mods folder. If you can't see it, right click on some blank space and create it. Come into it. You can go and see I already have a mod in here. I'm going to go and delete it though. If you go and have conflicting mods for different versions, it can cause a problem. And you can come return to your downloads and you want to go and drag and drop the mod in like so. If you've got multiple, add them. We can then close it, back, come back to Forge and go over to the right and click play. On the home screen, you can press mods and you'll go and see it. And now let's get into a world. In the top right, you can go and see the mod. Of course, you may have got a different one. 